Hello guys, this video is about coins and I see a lot of people um, they are hoarding uh, copper uh, like for, penny, for uh, one cent now most of the people you know as, uh, as you might know that um, uh, from uh, 1982 and ender all the penny um, pennies are copper except for uh, 1943 which is uh, steel okay so people they collect these copper pennies and they think that in the future um, they can sell the coins for their copper not for for the real uh, value of the penny okay so instead of searching for copper by year which is exhausting you can uh, sort pennies the very easy way okay there is a a penny uh, a copper penny sorter in the market you you can find it in eBay or you find it in Amazon or Google you just Google it now or some stores this machine if you uh, buy uh, if you bring a box of uh, uh, twenty five dollars penny cents, so you just bring them from the bank and throw the coins to the machine, and it sources into two. One is copper, the other is not copper. Now, how do you make your money from this copper? Instead of waiting. If the theory is correct, okay, instead of investing for the long run, 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, you don't know if the government allows in the future melting copper, as they say, because this is what they what they want, uh, these, these hoarders. I, I don't understand how these people think, but I will make more videos explaining this, but those people... They can't learn a new thing. This is the problem. They can't change. They see the money from one side and they do the opposite. Okay? Now, I will show you a way to make 50% of your money right now. Why you wait uh, 10 years, 20 years, 30 years? And you don't even know in the future how the, uh, how the copper will be. Maybe it will be less, maybe it will be more, okay? And if the government doesn't allow to melt copper, because they have, the government has a reason, okay? I will not discuss this again here in this video, but I will just show you very quick. Now, what do you do? You bring $25 pennies from the bank, okay? All the banks here in the United States of America. You go to the bank, you say, okay, here is $25, give me pennies. They give you a box of pennies. If they don't have, they order for you. Okay, so suppose they say, oh, we don't have. They should order, especially when it is your when it is your bank. Okay, when it is your bank. Other banks, if they, uh, it means it's, it's better to see your bank. Now, when you have this box, you open the rolls and you throw the coins into this machine and it will sort for you. Okay, this is the investment. The investment is to buy this machine. That's it. There, are, uh, I think this machine is to, uh, is from twenty-five dollars. Then we have fifty. We have one hundred. Depends on the capacity of this machine. Okay. Now, when the thing, when the coins are sorted, you you take this uh, copper pennies. What do you do? The easy way is to look in your town or your city for antique shops. Most of the antique shops, they accept to buy copper, okay? Now, for example, you have one cent, they give you 75 cents. Uh, they give you uh, like, uh, like one cent and a half. For example, you have, let's say, uh, a box like with $25, they give you $12 and a half as a profit. And this is 50%. Now, why I give you this, uh, this, uh, 
like this way to do the business because you try to bring from the bank sort you don't sort okay let the machine sh uh, sort for you so you are out of trouble now you have this sense either by pound you take them either by pound or by rolls and you take them to the local uh, uh, antique shop I don't think that the uh, that the um, um, what is it the uh, the other guys the dealers I don't think that they accept uh, to buy copper but I'm speaking about antique shops because there are pe there are holders that they could that they collect all this copper and they put it in their house and they th thinking that this copper will one day have the price the penny which is one cent and the copper for example is uh, three cents and a half so they can make a big bargain okay here i'm not discussing their way of doing business because it's the worst thing you do in your life when you hoard things it's the worst okay so when you go to your uh, you should have a relationship with with the antique shop and if he accepts to to take your money most of the time is 50 percent if you find more it is, is good 50 percent of your money is an excellent thing right now okay you, you should not wait like yeah 10 years 20 years 30 years and you don't know what will happen in the future so why not make money right now this is called what it's called the trading this is the beauty of trading is you don't hold you don't collect you don't uh, have something in your, in your house you just have something you buy something for example the uh, those pennies copper pennies you don't buy them you you get them with the fees value which this which is the best thing that you can do okay and then uh, you take them to the antique shop by pound or by roll and you get your money okay and if this you do it uh, it's it's feasible it's 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 something that you can do it okay if you have time and you want some extra money and um, you, you just do it you have 50% of your money and then you can grow your money faster and faster it's better than uh, you sort the, the pennies and then you hoard them and you put them in boxes and you put them in your storage and you wait for 10 years 20 years 30 years until the copper I don't know what what will happen to the copper but this is the best way as I see it for me for why I don't do it for me like for me I'm I'm uh, doing a stock market I'm buying and selling stocks so for me I can't I can't waste my time doing this because it it's 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 for me it's a lot of, it's a lot of things I have a lot to do I have other things to do for me I, I, I don't do um, this kind of things but sometimes I uh, I search for varieties or um, or errors and this has more money than than this 50%. So I am not I'm not uh, worrying about this 50%. But a lot of people who are just um, searching for a way to make money, this is I guess one of the best ways because who who can give you 50% of your money right now? It's it's uh, it's, it's something good. Now if you have questions please um, uh, comment or send me a private message you know my channel is not for uh, coin collection or something but uh, I add some videos because I'm interested in, uh, in, uh, in uh, uh, searching for coins valuable coins that's why I give some, some, some time some ideas about how to trade coins not to invest okay I am not I am for me in my life I'm against investing it's a waste of time and you bet on the future and it is one of the worst things you can do okay so hope uh, you you understand the lesson if you if you get the idea and it works for you please comment thank you very much